Hey guys, welcome to episode 3 of our uh, Fallen Giants FM22 save. In this video we're looking to extend our uh, good league form, climb to the top of the table and stay there, and then hopefully start working towards clinching the title. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, had a lot of fun making it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment on how to make these videos or this channel better, or so you guys like them better anyway. Um, glad you're stopping by, hope you enjoy. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, Leonidas here, continuing our save with Depor Deportiva La Coruña. We're going to jump right into it today, get into our first league match. We're facing Calahore, they're seventh in the league, we're first. We're not going to we're not gonna do anything too crazy here, we're going to keep the, keep the lineup more or less the same. Menudo's still going to start uh, in the center for us, that's the shadow striker position. Everyone else is staying the same, we're going to hop right into this game and uh, get this video off right. In case you're just catching the, the first video here, uh, we started this game, I think we're about six games in now. Doing really well. Uh, top of the table, looking for to win the league by promotion. That's our board's expectation of this season. We're in the third third flight division of uh, Spanish football, trying to get to La Liga Santador. Um, hopefully we can do it this time. Looks like we're getting our first highlight here. La Peña to Hector to Doncel. Up to Ferreira. Intercepted though. Carino was able to keep it out of the enemy's hands. Another clearance. Hector should be able to run onto it. To Doncel. Back to the middle. Hector's going to bring it up to Doncel. Up on the left. To the middle, Ooh, Ferreira couldn't could keep it down. Doing well on possession. XG early, doing good there. Go ahead and try to encourage these boys. McKay will reach it before it can pose any threat. La Pina will take it out of the defense. Doncel to Hector. Up on the left side. Wide cross. Ooh, that's that looks like it's gonna be a penalty. Ferreira as always will take it. Looking for our laser beam. There it is. Lower right corner. Goalkeeper saw where it was going, couldn't reach it. Ferreira, 13th goal this season. Great addition to the team right before the transfer window closed. And just an awesome effort on his part. Great shot, great finish. Good, good job overall to put us on top. So we're getting shots on target. We just need to, to finish them now. Subwise, everyone's pretty good. No one's playing too poorly. Aguari came back from Aguari. Uh, came back from an injury recently. I think I might put him in if uh, Hector keeps kind of struggling there on the wing. We're actually going to change this up, see if we can exploit the middle of the pitch if we drop it just a little bit narrower in our formation. Getting a cross here. Ferreira! Recently he has become dominant as our offensive weapon. That's two goals. The past two games, he's had a hat trick or more. Set the recently set the league record for most goals in a game of five. Great way to take a 2-0 lead on these guys. We got some guys starting to struggle. We played a lot of games. We haven't rotated too much. We'll go ahead and switch them out. Miko will come in, and then we're also going to put Alguari uh, in for Doncel and see if they can't start uh, contributing a little bit better. On the right flank, uh, I like Valin on the back half actually. So I'm gonna wait. Valeles. We'll keep him in for now. Long cross. We had a man there, he just didn't didn't do it. Hector's been struggling all day. We're gonna switch him out. 
Okay, tight game. Good offensively. Not our best match, but we, we came away with a win. Can't be too upset there. And it looks like Le Grand's, uh might have either lost or tied. Yep, they lost. So we're now three points ahead of the next team on the table. Looking good. Okay, boys, here we are. First real test of the season. Going up against the fourth team on the table. Match, match squad should be set. So Lille will definitely will need him on the bench. Okay, no change to our tactics. I think we can still control this game. Uh, we're the best team in the league. There's no reason we should be scared of anyone. So we're going to go ahead and hop right into this game here. I think we need to show everyone that their respect, their recent praise is justified. Put on a show. Couldn't agree more. Boys need to be excited for this one. This is why we play the game. We don't play to beat teams by five. We want hard wins that we have to earn. Don Saddle will get it in the middle. Push the ball up. Long. Oh. Oh my gosh. An absolute banger from extremely deep. Ferreira showing exactly what he is capable of. You cannot ask for a better strike there. Full extension from the goalkeeper, doesn't matter. The top shelf, an absolutely stunning strike by Ferreira. Just shows the caliber of player we have on our team right now. An absolute monster of a shot. Next highlight here, wide open for Tovar. To the middle of the pitch, Hector will push it to Lapina to Dancel, who will take it out. Outrunning that defender. Back to Hector. Ferreira. Wide to Cedric. Back to Victor. Looking to get the ball into the middle of the pitch. Menudo. To Ferreira. An absolute weapon. Showing at 30 years old, you can still dominate a league. With no one even close. Great cross. The header, top shelf, bounces down into the goal. Nothing the defender can do. Ferreira has been on an absolute hot streak the last couple games. They're going to get a corner here. Tovar can't keep it down, though. Good clearance. Opposition instructions have to come. We have to limit Tovar. We're going to mark him tightly. We're going to press him. We're going to go in hard on him. We have to get him under control. He's the only real threat we're seeing in these highlights. And that's it. We just sent a message to the entire league. It doesn't matter where you are in the league. We'll dominate you no matter what. 2-0 against the fourth team in the league who have been playing well and destroying a lot of teams out there. Could not be more pleased with your guys' performance. Well done. Now four points ahead of the closest team to us with a substantial goal differential, 20 compared to the next closest, which is nine, I think, down there with a Real Union. Okay, boys, here we go. Today we're facing La Granaise. It's uh, currently ranked third in the division. Um, no real changes to the lineup, no real changes to tactics. Uh, we still have Doncel and Hernandez on the left, Cedric and Victor Garcia on the right. Uh, recently, uh, Hernandez has been struggling on this left side, so if he keeps performing poorly, uh, we're most likely going to make uh, Arnau Sola uh, the starter. Uh, he's just been performing better in games and just coming through in the clutch when we needed him. On the right side, uh, we're looking to actually start Benito. Uh, he's been hurt 
for the past maybe three to four weeks. Um, but he's coming back from an injury. He was the starter. Victor Garcia is on loan. Uh, we would like to acquire him if we can just because he has long-term potential. Uh, but yeah, our, our, our actually player that we own is Benito. And then Valin has also been uh, in between Cedric and Victor's position. And then as always, complete forward, top scorer in the division I believe right now, best player on our team uh, in terms of in form, averaging an 8.14 average rating. Ferrara, Ferreira, 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 yep, I'll get it. Right, let's get right into this game. We'll get into this match. It's going to be a hard match no matter how, no matter what happens. Good team. They've had a good uh, goal differential recently, but I think we can do it. So, yeah, I think we need to show everyone that recent praise is justified. Put on a show. And then we're just going to max out everyone's motivation as much as we can. We're getting close with the team. You can see it by how, uh, how motivating we can be to them. When you're first starting out and you don't know the team that well or if you have a bad relationship, you won't be able to affect them during pep talks. They haven't had many attacks, but it looks like they're coming in hot here. There it is. Ari, Ari Dane, great goal from outside our penalty area. Uh, just no attackers really getting in his face. We're gonna have to put some opposition instructions to mark him more tightly. Uh, Ari Dane had the assist, it looks like. Quahar Zina was the actual score here. Let's back up. Let's see. Yeah, so he just wasn't marked, and by the time our player got uh, got into him, it was already too late. Great strike. This is the first time we've been down in a match, so we're gonna have to learn how to fight back here. We're out XGing them easily, but we're just not putting it in the net. They got one shot on target, and that's the one they scored. This is pretty unacceptable on our part. Our attackers just aren't producing today. We're going to switch out our Shadow Striker, see if Miko can't make something happen for us. Victor Garcia struggling. We're going to put in the, the starter. Vayen has been super good for us, though. Clean. We'll go with Benito, he's the starter, he's earned the job, we'll give him a shot. I'm thinking we might want to throw the bottle, this is pretty unacceptable. We'll throw the bottle, defenders aren't happy, that's fine. We gotta put more guys on the attack, we don't have, a, have any options. Try to overload the right side. We'll put Cedric in as a pressing forward on support to help out Ferreira. Actually, we'll go attack. You just get more guys in the box. See if that overload can't force anything to happen. stop on McKay there that would have been the, the game that's a tough loss we got to XG them there's no reason for us to lose that game they literally had one shot we had 21 shots 11 on target I don't understand that their goalie their goalie had an amazing game I guess he's got an eight that's a tough loss to swallow um, just embarrassed. That was horrible. Poor finishing all around. We stay at the top of the table, but people are closing in on us now. The bronze is catching us. Yep, snapped our eight-game undefeated streak. Just poor, poor, poor performance, poor finishing. We didn't deserve to lose that. That was complete BS. Yeah, I mean, he was bad. He was in poor form. Their, their goalie ex absolutely had a great, great game. Can't, can't take anything away from him. That's a tough one. Okay, here we go. First match back from that loss. First loss of the season. Really need to shoot back. We're playing a 
actually, I think they're the bottom, uh, the, the worst team in the league here. Um, I think it's time uh, for us to make a switch, though. Uh, Hernandez is good, but I think Sola, the new up-and-coming guy, might be better. We're going to play him this match, see how it goes. Um, besides that, we're going to keep it more or less the same. Uh, Valerez is still starting in uh, midfield for us. He's been doing a pretty good job all season as our box-to-box -box midfielder. Um, after that, no, no real significant changes here. Uh, Victor Garcia, I think we're actually going to start Benito. He's our starter. He's our natural guy. Um, I want to give him a shot to earn his position back in the, in the team. Uh, besides that, everyone else is staying the same up front. Yeah, we'll keep the everything the same. I don't want to make any drastic changes. We've been playing well. We had one off match. We beat them on XG. We just weren't finishing our shots. So let's dive into this game. We need to dominate them, return to form, and pick up where we left off uh, the last match. Stick to the plan. Stay patient. We'll be fine. Try to motivate these guys a little bit. Here we go, boys. Here we go. Free kick right outside their pen area. Doncel will take it. I think that's going to be offsides. Yep. Good shot by Doncel. Whoa. I don't know about that call. I don't know about that call. I think that if we had VAR, I think the upper leagues like La Liga Santador. VR might help us out there, but that was a tight call by the linesman. He thought he saw something. Uh, can't can't argue with it. Just got to move on. Through to Doncel. Oh gosh, we're creating these chances. Our players just aren't finishing. We've been struggling on winning corners all all year. Uh, I'm gonna have to after this match. I'm gonna dive into our corner tactics and see see what's going on. Something's not. We gotta we gotta start winning some some shots off these corners because right now we're just not performing. This is ridiculous. Come on. This is un unacceptable. I'm going to start switching out starters. Someone will score for us. If these guys want, I'll find someone who will. we have to score off a pen, I'll take it. Menudo, let's see who we want to actually take this. What's Menudo? Um, yeah, Menudo will take it. There it is. Up by one. We'll go back to positive. Good shot. It's on a pen though. It's not how we, we don't we can't be winning games on penalties, especially against the worst team in the league. There it is. Doesn't feel good to be scraping by against the lowest team, but a win's a win. We need to build our confidence up. We remain top of the table a number of teams chasing us down. Legrones, they tied, so they dropped down, but Racing de Santadore uh, is catching us pretty quick, so we don't really have much room. Okay, no real changes to our lineup. Uh, we're just going to hope that our starters kind of wake up after that win, and we have a good return to form here. Um, Lost and then barely scraping by that last team finish has me pretty uh, down on our luck if we're actually going to be able to achieve this title victory. But hopefully uh, if we can inspire our men, uh, this game will go well. We can play well throughout the rest of the season. Looks like we're getting our first. Oh, would have been a good highlight, would have been a good score, but he was offsides anyway. Okay, see if we can't have a good return to form here. Uh, another highlight starting with the opposition. Hopefully it's not going to lead to them scoring, but 
Who knows, man? We're in bad form right now. Got faith in the boys, don't get me wrong. Definitely have faith in the boys. I know they'll pull it out in the end, but um, need to start seeing some confidence from them. The defense just kind of building. Oh, wow. Poor form there. Uh, Going to move it up on the right wing here. Ooh, oh, would have been a good pass to Cedric, but it's okay. Uh, Verrez in the middle now. Over to Victor. Victor will move it up to Cedric. Looking for a cross. Goal! A goal from Friata. Beautiful goal. Could not be happy with that goal. Well done by Friata. Well done by Cedric to find him open the middle. Take a look at this replay. Garcia sees Cedric beating his man. One turn right to the middle. Ferreira beats the goalkeeper. And we're ahead by one, boys. Hopefully the men see that they can win. We're going to get a good return to form. Looks like we're having another highlight here. Cross deep from a free kick. Goal. That's what we needed. But Aneto with a great header. He's our top heading guy. We have uh, him as the target for most of our attacking corners as well. In the crowd. Great header to put us up by two now. The boys are rallying. I know it. They know we have faith. Faith in them. Faith to win. Well, that'll wrap this game up. Good job of the boys rallying off the past hard couple games. Winning 2-0 against a not horrible team in the league. Um, well done by them. I'm proud of them. We need to just keep this form now moving later into the season. Uh, hopefully we can keep it going. A little nervous about our chance. Oh, an injury. Really didn't need Benito to get hurt again the second time this season. Good job by uh, Granetto here. Um, hopefully we will encourage him to see how that goes. But... I think I'm going to wrap the video up here, boys. I appreciate you guys watching. appreciate all the support. I'm trying to keep these videos a little bit shorter. I know the first two were like close to an hour. Um, I'll be looking to keep them uh, closer to 20 minutes, 30 at most, just so it's a little bit more watchable when you're just going throughout your day. But I appreciate all the support. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. There will be a lot more coming out. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you liked. Let me know what you didn't like. And uh, I'll, I am very responsive to comments. So appreciate it. See you guys.